lowers the acetabulum, all right? Lowers the acetabulum. And it makes their leg longer, all right? It makes their leg longer when they're supine, all right? And then when they come up to sitting, all right, because of the anterior, because of the anterior inanimate rotation, all right, now, because when they come up to sitting, what it does is it pushes the acetabulum back, all right, because of that anterior rotation. So now it makes your leg shorter. You have to play with it. Okay, so it's kind of like you'd want to do the leg length test, so you just kind of want them to lift up and kind of clear their back down. It's good. Kind of clear, right? There's fine. All right, and then what you want to do is you want to... So you'd ask them, what side is your pain on? This side, okay? So are you serious? Yeah. You have some pain? Okay. So then when I look at, all right, I see that side is a little long. Right. In okay, in line. Okay. So then, what I want to do is, you can do one of two things. Some people are strong enough where they can sit up right by themselves, or you just want to give them a hand. So I'm going to have you sit up. Good. Okay. And then you look at it again. All right. And it didn't change. All right. See, so it's still really long. Okay. So it didn't change. So she doesn't have a rotation. All right, she might have something going on. It might be structural. It might be all right. But if she would have went like this, all right, she came up to city and went like this. So it went long to short, and short anterior. and all right. So it'd be an anterior rotation on.